Good morning, greetings, and salutations. This is your here and Elizo. And it's pancakes. <laughs> Welcome to another episode of the vlog. Eliza, show everyone what's for breakfast. It's breakfast time. What else? Bacon. Wow, uh, what's this in the, the orange stuff right here? What's the orange stuff? Cantaloupe. Cantaloupe? Yeah. Wow, it looks that delicious. <laughs> you guys made a beautiful pancake thing, but it started falling apart. But um, I did immortalize it in some photos, so. Oh, my timer's going off. Okay, just finished cleaning up right here. And now. Oops. Why did I leave that on? Um, I'm going to clean up. These are the uh, pieces that I showed you guys in yesterday's video. So if you guys want to check out that amazing thrift haul, go check it out. But right now I'm going to wash my Le Creuset and my new Yeti mug. Um, I might actually make a sushi bake in here today. We'll see. But I'm going to wash all this stuff right now. I feel like I should have shown you guys how this looked before I cleaned it. Um, so I'll try to insert a photo if I remember how it looked. But if you guys do follow me on Instagram, I did post that on there too. But this is what I used. Um, bon Ami Powder Cleanser. Uh, works really well. I got almost all the marks off. Um, this might fade even more over time. But I'm not really worried about it because we're really just going to be using it ourselves anyway. But, um... The rest of it cleaned up super duper well, looks good as new, and I couldn't be happier. Um, the Yeti was already in really good shape, but I'm actually just going to run it through the dishwasher along with the lid, just because to be safe, and these are actually dishwasher safe anyway. Um, these, I need to try these. Mom and I are getting busy in the kitchen. I have some sushi rice cooking right there. See that sushi? going to make a sushi bake in my brand new... Le Creuset. Oh wait, do we have zucchini or cucumber still, Mom? Mm -hmm. Other than this new one? No, I already used it. Oh wait, how am I gonna make sushi bake without cucumber? Can I use this? Yeah, you can. I'm gonna use this for my sushi bake. Yeah, and Mom is over here. She made a cake. She's just making it inside our little all-purpose pan thing that we got, which is perfect because these can go into the oven. And we're feeling a little lazy today. <laughs> All right, so I'm getting my ingredients for my sushi bake ready. So far I have the cucumber in there. I have the avocado. We're gonna put some carrots after we chop them up some more. And then mom's over here and she's making a fancy salad. <laughs> mom said it's not fancy, but I'm saying it's fancy. With our, our homegrown cucumber, <laughs> yay. It seems like we get one every day. I know, but now we don't have any more. I think this, I is, pulled the them all out. this is the last one. Mom took out all of the cucumber plant, most of it. <laughs> Because it was like super overgrown and it wasn't really growing as many cucumbers anymore. It was just taking over the whole side of the planters. And taking over the jujube. <laughs> I know, this was growing. This is the one I showed you guys yesterday that was growing in the tree. <laughs> oh, I don't think I showed you guys on camera. I showed you guys on Instagram. I posted it on Instagram. You lie. So you guys should follow me on Instagram because I post stuff there all the time. <laughs> and I told Tanta. Yeah, if you just cut it a little bit so that they're like squares. Sayang to ha. Kumuha ka dun ng ano. Oh, you don't want me to pull yeah, use the other because, carrots. Because I can use the Alright, you guys. So. Today we're going to today try. Today we're going to try and grow this avocado grow because avocado. mom cut one the, and it already has a little tail. Little tail. Growing out of it. So that this is how you grow it. We've done it before. No, it's too high, Mom. I gotta do it, like, up here. Mm -hmm. There you go. As long as it doesn't go inside of them. And we're gonna put it inside this little vessel. Yes. So we're gonna have to put a lot of water in. <laughs> <laughs> A little bit more, Mom. No, the whole no. bottom of it needs to be wet, no? no. There you go. Good. Yeah. There you go. Oh my gosh, that looks so crazy, but I love it. <laughs> so there's that. And then here's Mom's salad. Ooh, look at that. Looking good. Those are the e some of the eggs that Mom used for breakfast and for the cake. She's going to break down the shells and put them in the plants. Yeah. 
And then here is my sushi bake stuff. I'm gonna wrap this up and uh, wait till the rice is cooled down inside the thing. Then we'll finish making this because I'm also waiting for my imitation crab meat and stuff to um, thaw. Yeah. All right, so I have my rice right here. I'm gonna add some sugar to it. And then I'm going to add some red or I, well, rice wine vinegar. Yeah, rice wine and vinegar. Okay, just kidding, it's not rice wine, it's rice and vinegar. This is the one so that I use. Seasoned gourmet rice vinegar, diluted with water, 4.1% acidity. And we're gonna add this to the sushi. Rice. Add it like that. And then we're just gonna mix it up. All right, there we go. Okay, so there we go, guys. It's looking pretty good. Now I'm just gonna let this cool down before I add the topping, and then uh, we're ready to eat. There's the cake. Yay. Looks good. I totally missed mom marinating the chicken, but it looks delicious. It's pretty much salt, pepper, uh, lots of lime, uh, mom's special peri peri seasoning, and then a lot of butter. Yum. Did I miss anything? Oh, she also used um, some garlic salt as well. All right, guys, we're gonna add the topping. Oh yeah, this is amazing. Then we're going to add our four cocky. It's time to eat. Look at this delicious chicken. Mom topped it off with some flowers, too. Look at that. And then we have the sushi bake. Nice and warm and ready to go. And then we have our delicious fresh salad. Time to eat. Okay, we also just got the seaweed out, which is super exciting. Our rice. Now we're truly ready to eat. I had to show you guys my food yeah. first because it looks Me. really, really good. Mm. All right, you guys, here's the cake. It kind of got a little messed up because of the foil. But uh, I have some frosting. There wasn't a lot. So I'm going to write, like, happy unbirthday on it. I think it'll be really funny for the kids. So that's what I'm going to do right now. Happy on birthday. <laughs> it's a little bit of a hot mess, but it looks kind of cute, right? But I added a little bit more extra pizzazz to it just because I wanted to use all the frosting. Uh, but yeah, there we go. I'm not, I'm not ready. Happy on birthday. Happy on birthday. Okay. One, two, go. Merry, merry on birthday. Merry, merry on birthday. I didn't know. Merry on birthday. 
Say very, very merry and a very merry and birthday to you. To you, to you, very merry and birthday to you, to you. Yay! Okay, uh, blow up the blow candle. Day. Hendrix. Okay, Hendrix is going first. Okay, whoa, Zachary. Whoa. No, Zachary. Zachary, go next. Very, very careful. Yeah. Whoa. Eliza, where's your plate? Cake. Where's your plate? Where's your special cake? Your plate? Where's your plate? Okay, everybody. Cake. I am cutting cake. It is, it. Special cake. It is okay. happening. Oh, I can't believe Austin's actually cutting the cake. I'll cut little pieces. Okay, it's a big deal. I made it too small. Okay. <laughs> So Wait, cool. I'm not taking a, getting so a video small. taken of me, am I? Cause you are. Uh, yeah. Now everyone knows how well you can cut a cake. Woo! It's like it's gonna cut a circle in here. What? It was a joke. Okay, I'm ready. Who? <laughs> cake. It's gonna be like this. Oh, nice. Okay. Shh. That is such a tiny piece. Shh. It's called. I am giving. Wow, see? Well, you got two pieces of cake. You're so special. Me? Zach, would you like a little piece of cake? Yes, you have two oh. pieces. Oh, Eliza's already holding his fork. The... Eliza, are you holding your fork already? It's okay, you can take it out. You can take it out. Just try it, baby. Okay, anybody else that wants to cut their own situation? Madonna is like cutting cake and cake. I'm better at it. Can I have this? Can I have this, please? Kate, do you want more? Wow. I'm just gonna use my hand. Mom, can I have this, please? That's how I roll. I was, I was like the one with a lot of Stop frosting. poking the plastic. <laughs> You're gonna pierce it. You wanna eat fruit? Mm -hmm. Cantaloupe? You yeah. I want more cake. You want more cake? Okay, okay bring your plate, please. please. Good morning, you guys. It's the next day. We're gonna surprise mom with these sandals. They don't fit. <gasps> Just make off. Oh yeah, they don't fit. Ah, uh, sorry. The the left feet. The right, the other one yeah, fits you. Yeah, the left one fits. That's because your right foot's the bigger foot. The dominant. It looks like it fits when you push it all the way in. Stop. See, look at Yasmin. The See. From the inside, it looks like it. From the outside, it doesn't. It's toes too. Just a little bit. I mean, is anyone really gonna notice? Count it, count it long. So mom's gonna make calamari. And we are very excited. Kate, what's your favorite kind of calamari? Is the corn chicken? Well, one thousand hours. Okay, what's your favorite? I said I was just too loud, you can't hear him. <laughs> I know. Eliza, do you like calamari? Tell us again about oh, the does. science. Oh, it's in the gum. It's tell, oh. tell us again it's the science behind the pickles. What? Tell us, the tell us about the science. About the, the pickles. Grab ones. Uh -huh. Put it into a cup. Uh-huh. Grab a pickle. Mm-hmm. Dip it inside the ones. Okay. And then mix the pick pickle like this. Uh-huh. Oh and then it turns green. Oh, and that is? Pickle experiments. Oh. Pickle experiments. experiments. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Oh, and then tell them what everyone has to do after mommy's school. What does everyone and mommy's done? What mommy go? They have to play one for one thousand hours. Play what? One thousand hours. If they're done with mommy school, they have to they have to paint for one thousand hours. You're gonna paint for a thousand hours, Eliza? 
But do you how do you like your things that's that I got you? Oh how do you like those? You got me. That's, that's, no, that's more than two How do you two like months. those? <laughs> Let's take a credit. Oh, one, oh, one minute time. Hendrix. Do how you do you know, get those things? You know a thousand hours is two months worth of is painting. That from mommy or sitting? from grandma? Is that from mommy or grandma? The paint. Is that Your crayon. No. This is for mommy. From mommy. And this is for me. Okay. And this is for Uncle Kid. Oh. This is for Sad. This is for Kate. This is for Grandma. Oh, I don't know it's my favorite. Grandpa? <laughs> grandma gets the brown. <laughs> How about you, Thackeray Banks? What are you doing over here? Are you zoning out, <gasps> man? Are you zoning out? Are you gonna be who's gonna be number one finishing mommy's school today? Me! Not me! I think it's gonna be Cade. He's he's Cade? Going. For the first time no, in forever. No, I just looked at him. No, he's only on his second or his third page. Well, okay. <laughs> Let's go. Cade, you can't eat calamari oh, until no, you're done. Oh, I'm gonna eat all the calamari. Uh, and so, yeah. on, on, I'm gonna on, eat all the calamari. calamari. Are you gonna eat you all of it, Eliza? He does like calamari. Eliza loves calamari. I like calamari. He says they're circle chicken nuggets. What about you, Zach? You like calamari? Hendrix likes calamari. You do. You had it before. You like calamari. You just don't remember. Last time I... Do you know what calamari is? Who is it? Who likes this? Who likes and it's delicious. What? I don't like it. All right, you guys. This... People always ask and I always show you guys, but... This is the tempura mix that you guys have to get because it's literally the best one. So you can buy these at the 99 Ranch Market. You can get them at like, where else? Like Korean markets maybe? Like H Mart? Sometimes they have it. Sometimes they have similar but not the same picture I think. Yeah, but just look for this. This is it. Yeah. Alright, so mom's preparing the calamari. So excited for this. Okay, so what's that other mixture that you're putting it in, Mom? Okay. You? So you double mix it, but then that already has water and yeah. a little oil. Okay, here's our first batch done. I'm gonna have to sample one and try it. So if you coat it twice, you get those, they're more puffier, and if you only coat them once, it looks like this. This is my favorite way. It's really, really good. That one has the wet batter. Yeah, this one has the wet batter. This, this one is one only is the dry. dry batter. I like the just the dry batter. It's really good, but they're both delicious. Alright, you guys. So Zachary is going to partake in the calamari challenge. And he's going to try this delicious calamari. And if he tries it, he's going to get a prize. Is he going to try it? Is he not? What's going to happen? <laughs> what do you think, YouTube? Do you think Zach's going to do it? Is he going to try it? Okay, so Kate's going to try it first. Here we go. Here we go. So is, is this wet over there? Yeah. Whoa. Who's going to try one next? Eliza? I think I'm You're going to try it next, Zachary Binks? All right. Yep. Zachary Binks, let's go. Number one. Oh, not that one. That one looks a little... No, this yeah, one's delicious. One okay, Eliza's gonna eat this one. Can I that one? I want to get Is it yummy? Wow! All right. The moment you all the fans have been waiting for. The moment all the fans have been waiting for is Zachary Binks gonna try a calamari. Whoa! He's eating it. How is it? Is that an upside down, upside down? Thumbs up? Is it upside down day? He it's, likes it! It's a thumbs down! <laughs> Did you like it, yes or no? Look at someone has a thumbs up. What about you, Eliza? How about you, Thackeray Binks? What's your conclusion? What? About the calamari. It's uh, 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 really satisfying. Oh, see, you liked it. Are you gonna eat another one? Put a meme in the put spam spam spam. 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 Sp
spam this as a meme in the chat if, if, if that you thought if you were gonna make a meme about that. What you the post office is gonna drop off a couple packages. Alright, you guys got the Trader Joe's. Looks like there's a line unfortunately. And it's a pretty warm day. But um looks like there's a little shade, so hopefully it's not gonna be too bad. Too long of a wait. What I did come here for. Oh my gosh, they have the garlic spread back. So excited. I still have one left though. I'm looking for snacks. Let's get some of these. Might be good. I'm looking for... Ah, here we go. This is what mom likes. We'll get two of these for her. And we'll also get two of these. And I think we're set is in this section. Oh wait, tempura cauliflower. Yeah, two bags of that. Two bags of Kung Pao chicken. And two bags of orange chicken. Ah, uh, my dreams are fulfilled. I'm looking for snacks for the kids because I told them I would get them so Oh, I'm gonna get them these because they love those kinds of little fruit snack things. So definitely getting those. All right, just got all the groceries in here. Now we're gonna head over to Albertsons because I need to get a couple things from over there. All right, just got to Albertsons. What do I need? I need shredded cheese. I need tortillas and I need like fruit cocktail. <laughs> they always have like the funnest stuff here. Shamu. All right, shredded cheddar. We'll do sharp cheddar. Then we have our tortillas. And our fruit cocktail, here you go. I got some meat and I also got some oat milk as well. All right you guys, I just got home. Do a quick haul of what I got at the grocery store. So I got tortillas and cheddar for mom. And your two fruit, fruit cocktails. cocktails. I already made my <laughs> I mean, I got the little angels some uh, gummy tummies. And then I got, I got you a bunch of chips. I got you ghost pepper chips. Wow. And, mom, I got you ghost pepper chips, truffle, and then I got those oh, veggie straws. Oh, I got those. Then I got um, this beef for our bulalo for our soup so good mom's gonna make some tomorrow because i bought it <laughs> and then i got tempura cauliflower i got orange chicken and i got kung pao chicken which is here at the bottom uh so good yum eliza guess what I have a surprise for you. What? Where is it? Hmm. Where did you put it? <gasps> you already see it? What is it? Oh, <gasps> oh, one of them. Only one of them is for you. The other ones are for your brother. Show the camera. What is it? Marshmallow? Can you? Oh, you have to read it. Can you read it? Show them your reading skills. Let's open it and see what's inside. <laughs> no, you have to read it. What does it say? U M N Y. Uh huh. G uh, M M. Y Y G. Uh, M M. What does it sound like? N. What does it sound like? 
Eliza, what happened to your powers? Gummy. G G uh me. Gummy. I did do gummy chocolate. A gummy and then what's the other word? T uh mm, ease. Tummies. Gummy tummies. Ah! Gummy tummy. Okay, you wanna open it? Yeah. Tell everyone on YouTube what they look like. Oh, <gasps> what is that? Gummy tummy. What is that? A little penguin? No. How cute. Yeah, it's a little penguin with a tummy. And he has jelly in his tummy. <laughs> Try it. Tell me, tell me what flavor it is. What does it taste like? Nothing. Nothing. His face. You don't like it? <laughs> what? So check it out, this is why I bought the fruit cocktail because mom was making her famous macaroni salad. I have my little yum bowl because I'm very excited to eat this and it's super fresh and super delicious. If you guys want the recipe, it's Adrian's mom on Instagram. I'm sure she'll love to give it to you. Go message her, make sure you follow her and um, ask her for the recipe because it's really, really good. All right, you guys, so right now, I'm gonna make some Kung Pao chicken. So excited. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna heat up some oil on here for my chicken. Then I'm gonna throw it in there. All right, now I got my chicken cooking. All right, I have this in the oven, and I'm gonna go make the Kung Pao cauliflower. All right, now I'm gonna make this tempura cauliflower. My favorite, you guys, this is so good. Guys, the kids are singing karaoke. It's so cute. I hope you guys follow me on Instagram so you can see it because I'm posting it on there because songs are copyrighted. Leslie got 92? Wow, you're so good. All right, you guys, the food is looking delicious. So excited to eat. We're eating and Yasmin's serenading us. I hope we don't get demonetized. Cool.